all to our most exciting and official name change event here at what is known as Downtown Disney. But not for long. So many dedicated and creative people have been working and will continue to work toward our future grand opening to make Disney Springs one of the world's finest and unique shopping, dining, and entertainment complexes. And here to tell us more about the exciting work, dynamic teams, and exciting developments is Senior Vice President of Disney Springs and ESPN Wild World of Sports, Mary Beth Byzantine. Hello, everybody. So thank you, Mark, and thank you, everyone, and thank you, Magician Moreau, for such an amazing close-up magic. Kind of hoping that if I give you my um, business card later, you can turn it into something special. So, it was two and a half years ago that we announced what was coming here at the Shopping, Dining, and Entertainment District of Walt Disney World Resort. This has been and continues to be an extremely popular destination for all of our guests. From our Central Florida residents who love to come here for a great day away from it all, to our guests who are sometimes crossing the ocean to visit this magic and would not consider the trip complete without a stop right here. To understand how popular this place is, consider this. We are blessed with a number of businesses here that have a net presence. With retail locations in places such as Times Square or downtown LA. Yet for many of those businesses, the Walt Disney World location is their flagship location. What's really impressive is the tenants that have opened so far have quickly become their top selling locations in their franchises. Given that popularity, it is understandable that we decided to double the number of shopping, dining, and entertainment locations here from 75 to 150. To do that, we decided to add to and double the size of the district. We knew that we would need more parking, but we wanted to keep all of it convenient for our guests. So the amazing people at Reedy Creek Improvement District created two beautiful, modern parking garages and an improved roadway system that's going to feed directly from Interstate 4. And as we planned this, we thought about what do people love about Disney? We know that we are world famous for our ability to create themed places, that we are perfect at making memories, places with a story behind them. So we thought about this place and said, why not? Let's create a story for this place that our guests will love. Let's create the story of a town. Our Disney Imagineers did what they do the best. They imagined a beautiful Florida lakeside town that thrived with local industry at the beginning of the last century. And then they managed to keep its beauty and its rustic charm as it was adapted and became a popular destination for 21st century vacationers. Towns that have neighborhoods and this place has four of them. So today we are gathered here in the Landing, a tasty waterfront district overflowing with spectacular flavors. Next door is Town Center with its unique boutiques, one-of-a-kind flagship stores, and a playful promenade in which you can relax, refresh, and reconnect. To our east is Marketplace. From crystal glass coaches to sportswear with a Disney flair, it's one of the most hip Disney shopping experiences on earth. And on our west side, you can ignite your senses with the sound of applause for world-renowned shows and the tempting aromas of treats just waiting to be discovered. And in the center of these four neighborhoods, you'll find the beautiful springs for which this one-of-a-kind spot is named for. It takes a lot of creativity to imagine all that, and it also takes time to build all of that. We're still working to make that dream come true. And I would be remiss if I did not point out that throughout this transition, our unbelievably dedicated cast have delivered a world-class and Disney-level experience for our guests, an experience that they have raved about and loved. 
and even as we build tomorrow's experience around them. And we actually have a gentleman here today who has been an incredibly positive leader, relentlessly dedicated to pleasing our guests yesterday, today, and tomorrow. And I really want to recognize him right now. So Keith Bradford, our Vice President of Disney Springs, please stand and give a wave to the crowd. I just can't thank you enough for all that you're doing to make this place so incredibly magical. And you've got a few fans up here as well. <laughs> I'm so proud of everything that you've accomplished and all that we're going to continue to do here together. So at this point, I'll hand it back to you. Thank you very much, Mary Beth. <laughs> Folks, today marks a milestone moment in the history of this project and the history of the Walt Disney World Resort and our cast members that made downtown Disney great. And just look around you. It's only going to get bigger and better. And now I'd like to invite to the stage the president of the Walt Disney World Resort, George A. Calagridis. Thank you, Mark, and good evening, everybody. I'd like to thank everyone for joining us today. And Keith, I too want to acknowledge you. It's a challenge to deliver one world-class experience even as you build another, but you and your team have certainly done it. And of course, I want to acknowledge our cast members, operating participants, and Imagineers who've all been delivering exceptional guest experiences even as we have been working and building here. Now, as you know, no project of this size and scope can be successful unless it has the support of its neighbors. We at Disney are thankful every day for this Central Florida community, which not only supports expansions such as this, but makes Disney a part of the fabric of its life. From working with us on community projects to coming out to enjoy the magic, Central Florida has been vitally important to Walt Disney World for 44 years. We are proud to be part of what makes this region such a world-famous destination. We take great pride in being good neighbors and partners in the community where we live, work, and play. By the time Town Center is complete, this expansion will have provided an estimated 1,200 construction jobs and added more than 4,000 operational roles while providing new business opportunities and creating significant revenue and tax revenue for our community. Even today, one in every 50 jobs in the state of Florida is tied directly or indirectly to Disney. We're very pleased that as Disney grows, the economy around us grows as well. Well, we have a lot to celebrate and the perfect place in which to celebrate it. All we need is a name. And Mark, I understand that you have appropriately have an appropriately magical way of doing just that. Well, of course, George. All right. Thank you, George. Now, it is now time for our official name change moment. I would like to invite back to the stage Mary Beth, Keith, and representatives of our wonderful cast to join us here for our official dedication moment. Our cast has beautifully embraced the transformation of downtown Disney into Disney Springs, and we're excited about all the great news to come. And just like our magician Moreau, we have one more magical transformation tonight. Leading our cast are our Walt Disney World ambassadors, Caitlin and Nathaniel, who have been a very important part of every fun and exciting grand opening here at Disney Springs. The best is yet Come and stay in your mind. Come and stay in your mind. I got plans for you, baby. And baby, you're gonna fly. Disney Springs! Thank you very much to George, Mary Beth, Keith, and our cast. And thank you for joining us, and we hope you enjoy the fun, food, and entertainment that is beautiful Disney Springs.